We've all heard of Falling Water, Frank Lloyd Wright's masterpiece in the Laurel Highlands, but have you heard of Polymath Park? Yeah, it's another architectural gem related to the famous architect, and this one has a really unique twist. It's also home to an award-winning restaurant where you can literally dine in an actual treehouse. <laughs> so we sent Boaz there to check it out. It might look like I'm wandering through an Ewok village, but in fact, I'm just an hour from Pittsburgh at Polymath Park in the Laurel Highlands. I'm here with Robert, who's a tour guide here, and you do some PR as well. And so for folks who aren't familiar with it, what is Polymath Park? I mean, it's a lot of things, really. It's quite a few things. I mean, first, we have the homes that were actually saved and relocated to the property that were designed by Frank Lloyd Wright. Uh -huh. Not only that, the adjacent property here that this all sits on, uh, it was actually the original location of two homes designed by an apprentice of Frank Lloyd Wright. Oh, wow. And he was a local named Peter Bernston. Uh -huh. And this was all founded and still operated today by Tom and Heather Papinchak. And what is now Treetops Restaurant actually used to be their home. Oh, wow. Right over here. Yep. This was their house. Yeah. And they actually bought it. And then they bought the adjacent property. And with that, they were going to be the preservers of those two homes yeah. and actually not long after purchasing the property it there was a Frank Lloyd Wright that needed to be saved and it was actually originally in Illinois it was called the Duncan House and Tom actually s stepped up and preserved that home by wow. re reconstructing it here on I the property I can't imagine itself. that's easy to rebuild the house it's like the worst <laughs> jigsaw puzzle in the world it's something that, yeah um, and then he did it again he did it again with a home from Cloquet Minnesota as wow. well and, and so now so there are four houses you can tour you can tour and spend the night and we actually offer dinner tour packages as well wow. so you don't have to just come here to eat or just a tour you can and that's much... where these sort of tree houses tree pods come in because you can eat in here this is like a, a private dining room you can come here with your friends and, yep. and eat in the tree house absolutely dining pods started about four years ago and they're very popular and we don't just offer dinner we yeah. actually have tapas we have brunch and we have tour packages that you can actually kind of combine everything together well i i heard you got some snacks going for us in here so let's go check absolutely. it out absolutely Oh wow, this is so magical in here. It's really like you're in this little magical little tree house. This is so cool. Very unique. Yeah, I feel like where else can you dine in a location like this? And we've got some snacks coming in too. We oh. do, all right. Wow, okay, what do we have here? So this is our smoked open face burrata. Oh wow. So you have some seasonal uh, tomatoes with a uh, garlic, olive oil base, and some lovely pita and um, fresh basil to enjoy with it. That's so cool. And the menu here is pretty unique because when you make a reservation, you get to make some decisions, but then there's also a little surprise. Yes, that's true. So most of our guests, you get to choose your main course, and then our chef chooses the other courses. So it's a really fun experience because you get to experience things that you normally wouldn't, but we make sure that it's dishes that you'll actually enjoy as well. And then, of course, we accommodate any dietary restrictions and allergies also uh, per each guest. Yeah. So if one person is a vegetarian, and everything would be catered to them while their partner could enjoy the things that they enjoy as well. Well, thanks so much for having us. You're welcome. Well, we're gonna dig in here. We gotta taste some of this stuff. Yes, get right in there. Oh my gosh, sorry, is this I'm getting a little messy. This looks great. Mmm. Mmm. Pairs well with Frank Lloyd Wright architecture also. Very tasty. Yes. Thanks so much for the tour. Of course. That oh. is amazing. I love that he says it pairs so well with Frank Lloyd Wright architecture. <laughs> no, I'm glad he got to eat at the end. I was worried, yeah. like, I was like, oh, no, no. Eat, we have to see something. what's available. Yeah, it yeah. looks beautiful and so serene. The Treetop Restaurant serves dinner and lunch through Thursday, uh, Thursday through Monday, excuse me, and reservations are recommended. Yeah, it does make you want to go. Yeah. And while you're there, you can also get a tour of Polymath Park or even stay in a house built by Frank Lloyd Wright. So, so cool. we have all the details on our website, pittsburghtodaylive.com.